how to set up multi-output instruments here in Studio One. So here we have Contact, which is a multi-output instrument. And as you can see, I have this here routed to Stereo One, and this here uh, instrument is routed to Stereo Two, okay? Now, if I just solo this, we don't hear anything. We know it's making noise if we check our outputs here in Contact, and I'm not gonna get into how to do this here in Contact, but I have a much longer video showing how to set up your outputs uh, in Contact We're using Pro Tools. It's actually much easier to do here in uh, Studio One. I like to have a preset, so I just select my 14 stereo out, and then I have all of my uh, outputs here that I can uh, route my instruments to. So again, we can see we're getting output from Contact, but we don't hear it in Studio One. That's because we have to set that up. So we'll come to our mixer here and come over here to your instruments. If it's not showing, just click instrument right there. And contact five, use your down arrow and expand. And right here are all of our outputs from contact. So if I activate stereo channel two, and let me move this out of the way so you can see this. Activate two, three, four, so on and so forth. We can of course come down here and name these if we want, but let's just do two for now. Pull this back over here. Now this is still soloed. Again, it's still going out to two. And now we get that sound here in Studio One. So take that off a of solo. And now we can play both of these at the same time. As you can see down here, and they are on separate tracks. So then you can go ahead and put any plugins you want on these uh, individual tracks. All right. Same thing if I wanted to do something here, already have it routed out to stereo channel three, put that on solo. It's coming out of contact, we know that. Let's go ahead and hide our outputs here. But again, we don't hear it in studio one. Now there's another way to get to this uh, menu and you can hit up here to this icon and it says outputs, select that. And it's the same thing as coming over here. So this might be a little bit quicker if you want to uh, do it this way. So activate that, you can see our track is added four, five, six, seven. So now I play that. There you go. That's how you can do your multi outputs here in Studio One. And we'll do one more instrument just for those who want to uh, see it again. So we'll bring up our Northern drums here and just hear that, right? If I change our output to 16 out and we play back, I'm just getting the kick. And that's because just the kick is coming out of uh, one. So again, head up here, activate that, or come down here to mix again, and do it this way. If you prefer, activate whatever channels that we need. You can see them being added right down there. And there we go. So now we have all of our drums on all of these uh, separate channels here. And of course, put any plugins on each of these individual tracks uh, that you want, any effect at all. All right, so that is how you can use your multi output instruments here in Studio One. Again, over here in your mixer, instrument, and expand that, or directly within the instrument as well.